Hello there, this is Caesar on Toast, and you're watching episode 15 of my Better Minecraft Modded Minecraft Let's Play series. In today's episode, I'm feeling quite bossy, so I've got a confession to make, actually, which is that I've never actually beaten a raid. To be fair, I've never really tried that hard to, but I think now is the time. Now that we have such OP gear, that it makes zero sense not to try and beat a raid if it means that we can get the prices down in the village, which I think is what you get from uh, beating one of these things. So yeah, that's what I was looking for. So I need to beat these pillager, illager, whatever these guys are called, and uh, then we will be able to go to the nearby village and start a raid. I'm not going to bring any potions or anything. I think I'm pretty well geared. I've just noticed there's another one of these weird temples here, which uh, we should check out later for sure. But let's check on our map to see what villages are nearby. Looks like we got a swamp one, which should act in our favor. Lots of water will mean that the mobs will get stuck on the various uh, water blocks and, and get slowed down on their way into the village. Um, yeah, sorry for ruining your peaceful day here, villagers. <laughs> and I hope that bell sound isn't too loud for you guys. So, um, using our map to our advantage, I can see that there are some pillagers spawning to the north. So I'm just going to go ahead and long range these guys. Uh, hopefully we can clear them out pretty quickly this way. Their loot is so good. I want all the emeralds. I, I wonder how many we're going to be able to get from this. All right, round one done already. On to round two. I'm going to get back central into the village so we don't get anyone spawning right on top of us. Okay, this time coming from the west. Let's go get him. I knew the swamp was a good idea. These guys can't get to me. <laughs> I'm not cheesing it. You're cheesing it. Okay, round three going to start soon. Let's see if I can sleep while this is going on. Obviously can't sleep during a round if mobs are nearby, but yep, sleeping bag saves the day once again. Round three starting, looks like they're coming from the north again. Okay, if I come in from the right angle here, I can snipe a few of them as I pass. Ooh, they got a illager beast. Uh-oh, summoner. Want to get rid of them quickly. Uh, guys, I'm over here. <laughs> they haven't realized yet. Got him. Nice. Ooh, and he drops a saddle. That's really cool. Oh, is this a witch hat? Can I equip it? No. Oh, no time for that. They're coming from the east again. Or west, sorry. Okay, get the red guy first. Oh, I'm blind. Okay. Just fire blindly. Five more seconds. How long is this blindness lasting? Ah. Okay. I think I've gone upwards. There we go. All right. Let's clear them out. Do not want to get poisoned. Oh, they've actually made it into the village. No, stop. Don't kill my villagers. I hear bad things happening. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Basher. Yeah, he's got a shield. Okay, one remaining. Right, what I'm going to do, since it is raining... Okay, after this round, I'm going to use the hammock to reset the rain. Where's this last guy? Okay, they're running away from something over here. Ah, husks. Why are these guys here? This isn't the desert. Unless they came off the beach. Oh! Last pillager. Okay, cool. Better go sleep quickly. I totally lost track of where my hammock was. Ah, uh, they're coming. Ah! Okay, sleep quickly. Don't wake me up, guys. Or I'll kill you. I promise. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna kill you anyway. Whoa! He's riding on it! Okay, kill the special looking ones first. Because they're the ones who could do a lot of damage. Okay, and you, Ravager. Stay back. Okay, there's a red guy in there. Whoa, okay. <laughs> Another challenge complete, I guess. Wasn't expecting anything to pop there, so that startled me a bit. Okay, this run's nearly done, and then I can skip to the morning again, and hopefully it doesn't rain this time. Come on, witch. 
Okay, over here. This isn't so much of a raid as a siege now, because I'm on day three in Minecraft days of the siege. <laughs> okay, more of the same. They're up there again. Uh-oh. Okay, they're firing rockets at me with their crossbows. I'm getting out of here. Okay, I'm in the water somehow. Okay, blindness is receding. Right, who did that? I think it was these guys. They teleport? No. These guys are like assassins. They're coming to get me. They <laughs> they know my weakness. Right, but I'll, I'll kill everyone else first though. Uh-oh. He's doing something with his hands. I don't think they thought this raid through, to be fair. They're, uh, <laughs> not changing their tactics after I decimate each round. How can they expect to, uh, perform any differently if they keep doing the same thing? Whoa, so many drops. What is that? Uh-huh, really? <laughs> That's the name of the advancement? <laughs> oh, dear. All right, so many emeralds, though. Okay, uh, how many rounds are in this, by the way? I have no idea. I think this is round five now. Okay, if they come around this way, they can actually get to the village, so I need to just peel off the ones who are coming through. The bashers are especially annoying because they can put up the shield. Oh, uh, I knew they were about to be on me. Okay, can I do this? Okay, no, I can't get that close. No, guys, stay out, stay out. I don't want the magic ones getting anywhere near the village. Because they can do a lot of damage. Get out of here. If there were any of these guys that could fly, that would be devastating. But as long as water is an obstacle for them, I'm happy. Uh-oh. <laughs> I'm still killing them with my bow even though I'm blind. Oh, get out of here. <laughs> He's so sad. Goodbye. Uh oh, what are you doing? Uh, get those out of here. I do not want to fight those. Come here, guy. Oh, who keeps making me blind? It's so unfair. <laughs> uh, no, don't attack him. Okay, someone's over here. I'm gonna get you. I think he died. <laughs> or he went away. Either way, I'm I'm safe here. Uh, maybe someone's summoning the husks. Possibly that guy? And why are you here again? There's always one with the banner right there. Oh, sneaky dude. Two raiders remaining. Oh, uh, did did someone convert the guards into zombies? All right, last guy. And then is it win? Did I win? Woohoo! Champion of the village. Finally. That was uh, <laughs> pretty anticlimactic. The only ones who posed a even minor threat were the ones who were blinding me because when they did that everyone else could pile <laughs> pile on top without me realizing but yeah i won i'm the hero of the village and what this does if i remember correctly is it gives me a discount on all of the trades i don't know for how long that is maybe until i die or maybe until i leave the village but uh, definitely a, a worthwhile thing if you're trading with villagers and can afford to maybe lose one or two. Just make sure the ones that uh, you want to keep are locked down securely before you trigger the raid. That's all I'm going to say on that one. Okay, so I was just messing around with a couple of the drops I got from the raid. And the first one was the raid horn. And I held right click, I'm not going to do the full thing now, and it sort of did a squeak. And then I tried it again, just because I thought maybe I did something wrong. And a bunch of pillagers appeared. I've not killed them. And yeah, it's not giving me bad omen too. These seem to be... Uh, there's an illager expansion mod. Possibly this is like a second level raid. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try it out and see if any different guys spawn. I'm going to try that. But first of all, I also was checking out the Ravager Horn. And this can be used for a couple of things. If I hit you, you can see this can be turned into a gilded horn. 
and then that can be turned into a horn of sight. So I'm hoping this is something that can cure blindness. You just need this hallowed gem, which is some items that I probably have. Maybe not the illusionary dust. This is maybe what the mages were dropping. So I'm going to try and craft that uh, up. All right, so I got the horn of sight here. Uh-huh. Uh, what's going on here? <laughs> that did nothing. Well, we'll trigger the raid and see if I can get any interesting wizards to blind me so I can try that one out. Okay, but first of all, let's uh, toss that in the backpack and let's go back into the village and trigger another raid. Here we go. I'm also going to clear a little bit of this land because this is where they were getting in last time. So the slower they are at getting in, the more I can kill on their way. Okay, looks like they're starting from the south though. You haven't done that before. <laughs> Cheating. Don't hit the bee. Oh, you killed the guard. So cruel. Oh, yeah, on to round two. Hopefully they spawn to the north or the west this time. South again. Get him, bees. Oh, he's got a shield. Raid captain. I didn't know they had names. Get out of here. Okay, on to round three already. This is a uh, good pace this time. South again, and they got pillager beasts. Go, 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 go. Why do I keep calling the pillager beasts? Ravagers. <laughs> they killed their own guy! Guys, you're so savage. This is why you lose. You don't look after your own people. If they had healers, that would be uh, crazy. Okay, and he dropped another horn so we can always trigger another one of these. That's cool. They seem to really like the south side this time, so I'm going to stick around here. Oh, come on, the one time. Where are you? Okay, I'm going to stay on top of this tree. Well, that plan lasted long. They like to get onto that lily padded spinneroid. Oh, no. Get the witches. No, slowness again. Okay, another round beginning soon. Let's grab the loot. Uh, right next to me, right next to me. No, 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 no. Gotta get out of here. Ah, there's Vex. Okay. No one blinded me yet, though, so I haven't been able to try the horn. Oh, Vex, leave me alone. You know, guys, instead of just pointing your crossbows at me, you could shoot. That would make this a bit more of a challenge. Oh, he shot a skull at me, and he's summoning skeletons. All right, uh, you're actually kind of cool. <laughs> that must have been where the husks came from, whatever that guy was. Again, really, get out of my face. This is my area. I cleared you guys out. <laughs> Okay, blindness. Okay, so let's try this. Oh, that's what it does. That's cool. Now I can see where they are, even when I'm blind. Oh, this is actually even better than what I was thinking this was. <laughs> it doesn't tell you that trees are in the way, though. <laughs> Eagle Chavers, the raid captain. Captain of nothing, though. <laughs> Where's your raid, man? Gone. That's where. Okay, where are these guys this time? Okay, they're south, they're south. Okay, I need to get over there quickly. Magic fire! Ah! And it doesn't affect them! <laughs> I see why they did it that way. <laughs> Reduce friendly fire. Ah, pillager beast. Ravager, sorry. <laughs> I keep saying the wrong thing. Whoa! Okay, what was that? Whoa, okay. You're new. Inquisitor. Not so tough now, though. That guy's speedy. Okay, time to use the Horn of Sight. Why are they all so fast? This might be the last round, because that was kind of tough. Not really tough, but I had to think about things more and run away. One raider remaining. 
Is that that's that's them? Okay, got you. That's where the Vex were coming from as well. Oh no, there's more. <laughs> wow. Oh, they're coming from the south again. They're going to be right on me in a second. Okay, where are you guys? Uh, the beast is stuck. Ravager. The Ravager beast is stuck. Or just Ravager. I'm really not sure what I should be calling that one. <laughs> Ooh, the witch does heal them. That's so cool. They've got like a little bit of a <laughs> uh, synergy going on. That's really cool. Two remaining. Okay, I think one's over here. Oh, I won. They died. Why? <laughs> they were so scared of the horn noise that they just perished instantly. <laughs> cool. So what do I get for that one? Now that I've won, I'm hero of the village too. So there's kind of a tier system with raids. Um, must be the illager expansion mod that adds that that's that's really cool that they've added more types of villagers maybe uh but also more rounds to the raid um I, i'm pleasantly surprised to be fair those are i don't want to you know rag on the boss fights that i've done but that was that was quite fun you know not knowing which side they're going to come from and then they all had unexpected effects on me so yeah i definitely recommend checking out the raids in this mod pack once you've got good gear uh, like me maybe if you're a little bit less geared you would have more fun um but you could bring potions and things to counteract some of the other effects but yeah that was that was a good time i would do that again i'm gonna try and finish the last two bosses of mass destruction today and this is by far the coolest setting for any boss fight that i've done uh maybe bar the nether this or oh, sorry maybe bar the end this is the nether and it's really cool to see this arena. I've plugged a lot of the holes because I think most of the difficulty for this fight is going to come from trying to get around this arena. I've also tried to light up the place a little bit for you guys. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and start. This is the uh, nether gauntlet, I think is called. So you smash that block. And yeah, the nether gauntlet spawns. So this guy's going to try and punch us. It reminds me a lot of uh, the Zelda boss from the... Uh, from the Shadow Temple. I guess this is a little bit like the Shadow Temple itself in here. Okay, so we just have to hit him right in the eye whenever he's uh, got his hand open. So let's go ahead and try that. Okay, he's doing something different now. Lots of fire, should have brought some fire resist potions. No doubt. Oh, I'm in a hole, I'm in a hole, I'm in a hole, that's bad. All right, come, come at me, guy. Ooh, and he destroys blocks. Okay. <laughs> I found a nether quartz uh, geode over there, and I want to protect it, so I'm going to stay over this side for the rest of the fight. <laughs> Hopefully he doesn't set it all on fire. Ooh. I know what to do in this situation. Where's my horn of sight? Aha. You <laughs> can't blind me. Okay. Okay. Lava coming through. Lava coming through. He cracks the bricks, that's how he's breaking everything. Okay, right. Let's just fly up and out. I can do some of this while flying around, I bet. Oh no, I don't want to be standing on this roof. Come here, guy. Very low on health, very low on health. This reminds me of the Night Lich now, I'm just gonna fly around for the rest of the fight. Oh, oh. Why couldn't you stay in your own arena, guy? Oh, this is so cool. He's completely trashed the place. Whoa! Best boss fight! Gonna go blind. Look for the hand. Oh, nearly took a nosedive right into the lava there. This honestly feels like a superhero movie, the way that he's destroying the landscape, but I'm just flying around. Gotcha! Come on! Okay, I really want to finish the fight over the arena though, so in case he drops anything good, it's not going to fall into the lava and burn up. Oh, 
Oh, the pig men are angry at him. Okay. Come get me. Why so much health? Has he been regening this whole time? That's cheating. Okay, I got you now. You're stuck in here with me? Yes! <laughs> oh, cool, it spawns a chest at the end, so they, they thought of the fact that uh, it was going to drop everything into the into the lava if it didn't, so that's, that's very thoughtful of the mod maker there. So what do we get? The blazing eye, and this can be used to make the table of elevation for creative flight. That's really cool. And the blast amplifier. Oh, and there's ancient debris in this uh, little little cluster of blocks here. So I'll make sure to pick that up before we go um, and fight the next boss. Yeah, so I was saying that there were four bosses of mass destruction. The Night Lich, the Void Blossom, the Nether Gauntlet, and lastly, the Obsidolith. So we're going to go now and conquer the Obsidolith. Final boss time. So to find these guys, you've got to come to these big structures in the end. I found quite a number of them without spending a long time flying around. So I imagine they're rare, but not too rare. So I'd also recommend having a Lytra for this fight, by the way. I've never done it before, but if you don't, you're just going to fall off the edge. The last thing you need is the Eye of Ender, I think, just reading some comments online. And with that, we can activate the Obsidolith. Let's go. Oh, it looks so cool. There it is, the Obsidolith. Whoa, okay, into action time. <laughs> Let's see, what's gonna be a bow? Oh, it's, it's dinging me. I've also got slowness. Okay, there's these uh, obsidian pillars as well. Do I need to destroy these? Okay, if this is anything like the uh, Void Blossom, we're going to want to get rid of these pillars as they spawn in. The explosion's happening behind me. Go, go, go. Okay. Because they might be healing it. Oh, okay, it spawned in a new, a new pillar. That seems to be letting it do some different spells, so let's just keep a keep a lid on these. Whoa, 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 whoa. okay, 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 less of that. <laughs> I'm I'm not the one flying here, it's it's booting me up into the air. Whoa, Absolith, you are scary man. Can I hit you with the Nope, can't hit him with the sword. Right. Let's just keep on top of these pillars. Nearing the final quarter of health. There we go. Nice. Oh, that was such a good fight. It was short, but it it felt it felt tight. Yeah, <laughs> all of the little bits and pieces and components came together really nicely there. So uh, really pleased with that. And it seems to give you a, a shulker with some items in it. So if I can manage to get up there, we can take a look at what uh, the final reward for the bosses of mass destruction is. So what have we got? We've got the Obsidian Heart. This is the, the real key item here. We've got Smite Sword and Fire Protection 4 Diamond Leggings. I really don't need those, but I, I will take it. And what was on this? Curse of Vanishing. Okay, that's uh, <laughs> really... Uh, I, I'm just interested in the Obsidian Heart. So this one, we've already got the Earth Dive Spear. It's We've also got the Staff of Suppression, but this is the other thing we needed to make the Blast Amplifier which will increase our explosive power by 30%. So I'll try and find something to do with that in a future episode. Um, but that's everything I wanted to do today. And I'm so pleased that, that last, those last two fights were so, so fun. And, uh, you know, even though we got OP gear, they still gave me a run for my money at some points. Uh, had to go run away and heal both times. So pretty pleased with the progress there. And sorry if I'm giving you motion sickness flying around like this. Um, I'm just very excited by that Obsidolith fight and I'll probably do some more of those off camera and see if there's any more interesting loot. But that's going to be it for me for today. So as always, thank you very much for watching. If you did enjoy the video, 
please do leave a like on it, and if you want to see more content like this from me in the future, why not consider subscribing? Have a great day, and bye-bye.